All righty, we're doing this again. It didn't seem like that long ago we had another lunch for Capil. Not that long ago. Capil, stand up, everybody on the VR. There you go, stand up. I was asked to make some comments by my co-workers given the fiasco of the last time. I did have a long list of 15, 20 minutes, but I pitched that this week to this short one. Prepared statement by Philip Neidlinger on the occasion of Capil Rathod leaving us. I was asked by my co-workers in engineering branch to say a few things today. Now, those of you who know me well, at least think you do, realize that giving me free reign to speak my mind with few, if any consequences, with any consequences, is at best a bad idea. Well, my friends, here we are again. The last time I spoke was to issue an indictment, conviction, and sentence upon Capil for returning to the welcoming bosom that is Engineering Services Branch, Engineering Division, Director of the Public Works, Fort Stewart and Hern Army Airfield, Installation Management Command, United States Army, Department of Defense, Planet Earth. Hmm, whatever awaits him at Fort Eisenhower, which was formerly Fort Gordon, must be pretty daggum exciting to warrant his departure. I pray, and I'm sure that you do too, and he is making the best decision for himself and those he holds dear. Be that as it may, we will not tolerate any whining after your departure today. The die is cast, no deposit, no return. You're a big boy, put on your big boy pants. And of course, in doing so, leaving us all in a terrible lurch, Despite our love, affection, and admiration, he has effectively rendered him 